Hi, this is Josh and Michael with the Stern team at Keller Williams. Our goal is to keep you educated about all things real estate so you have the ability to make great decisions when it comes to your own home buying, selling, or investing goals. So today's topic is a question that came to us from Mr. Simonson. Should I buy a starter home in today's market? Friends and clients, should you invest in a starter home? Or is a better idea to wait and save for your forever home? First off, let's make sure we're talking about the same thing. Economists often define a starter home as being in the lower third of the market's valuation as opposed to trade-up homes and luxury homes. For many homeowners, however, a starter home isn't about price. Instead, it's about how long they plan to stay there, typically only a few years. And that's where the dilemma really lies. That's because buying and selling a home, as well as moving in and out, all have costs. And since the bulk of the mortgage payments for those first years go to interest, you are, you're also unlikely to build up much equity uh, if you only uh, own the home for a short period of time. In fact, according to one estimate, the break-even point for a starter home is somewhere between five and seven years. In other words, if you're planning to stay in the home for just a few years, then it may, might not make sense for you to buy in the first place. So are, are we telling you not to buy a starter home? No. See, there are definitely good situations in which a starter home makes perfect sense. For example, if you're planning on staying put for five years or more, a starter home will help you save some money on rent and will help you build up equity. Another option is if the home has potential and you can imagine it becoming your forever home with the right renovations or additions. Still, another option is if you're open to keeping the home and just renting it out later in case plans change. Ultimately, though, this will be a decision that's based Based on your own unique preferences and places. When, when you weigh all of that in, if you do decide that a starter home might make sense for you, then here's something important you should know. The best time to buy a starter home is coming up very soon. That's because fall and winter is the season when starter home inventory peaks and listing prices drop according to the real estate portal Trulia. This means you will have the most choice at the most affordable prices. If you're curious about what kinds of homes are becoming available around your area right now, take a look at this completing list. All right, so if you're also thinking that you might need to get a property sold, you can go ahead and click and get a, a free home evaluation. Either way, if you have questions about the current Wasatch Front real estate market, including whether a starter home is right for your unique circumstances, give us a call. It's 801-859-7509. We work this market every day and we're super happy to help. Have a great day.